Good morning, Titan Nation. Today is cold. It also happens to be Wednesday, January the 17th. Let's hear the morning announcements. There is an opportunity for you to get help with your FAFSA either this morning or next Wednesday in the afternoon. Um, follow this link to sign up. You also should have something in your email. For the cereal box donations, we're off to a great start. Um, collecting for the Touch Twice Clinic to happen later this spring. Remember the cereal box donation um, for the contest, it ends January the 26th. That's coming up um, right now. Currently in first place is Miss Cole's Advisory, and there's a tie for second with Mr. Denton and Mr. Neal's Advisories, and there is a total of only 27 boxes. So if one advisory, if everybody brought one, you guys are like instantly in first place. In Titan Time Thursday, there's an opportunity for students that are considering taking dual credit for the first time next year. If you're one of those that hasn't taken dual credit before and you're thinking about it and you already hit the benchmark score on mastery prep for reading, which is 20, sign up for a session called Dual Credit First Steps. Create an ID, I think that's what it is. Any questions, see your email, Ms. Burkhardt, or your guidance counselor, Mr. Collins and Mrs. Midkiff can help as well. In sports action today, we've got basketball, boys, freshmen, and JV are taking on Spencer County, and girls basketball is taking on presentation. And I have all those games listed as home games, so come on out and good luck, Titans. Speaking of sports and activities, next week is homecoming week. And here's a first look at those themes. Cool, those are the theme days and, but wait, there's more. Uh, there's gonna be kind of a cool, fun uh, contest activity deal, little rock, little paper, and maybe some scissors. I'm not gonna tell you what I'm throwing down, but check out this video to see more. Hey Zion Nation, this is Rochambeau. Rochambeau is a rock, paper, scissors tournament that gives students a chance to win amazing prizes. Monday through Thursday, you will be able to buy yourself a ticket during lunch during Hoka Spirit Week for the price of $1. The morning of Hoka, those students who bought a ticket will be brought down to the gym to receive their necklaces. Now throughout the whole day, students can challenge each other to take necklaces. Here are the rules. If a student challenges another student, they must say yes. The winner between two students takes the amount of necklaces they have around their neck from their opponent's neck. I challenge you. <laughs> okay, rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> yeah! Have you already lost? No, I'm still in. Then wear your neck. Make sure your necklaces are visible around your neck for your opponents to see. Rochambeau. Give me your necklace. Oh, man. Rochambeau. 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 Don't be tough. No fighting. If you lose your necklace early Friday morning, you can buy in one necklace for $2 during advisory. At the end of the day, during our pet rally, the top eight students will be entered into a Rochambeau tournament. At the pep rally, the winner of the eight core requires will have a choice to win either a yearbook or two prom tickets. The winner of the tournament will win their class to get with points. Teachers will also have necklaces that are worth double points, but you need at least five necklaces to challenge them. You can't lose your necklaces to a teacher, but if you lose to that teacher, you can't re-challenge them. Juniors, make sure to participate. Rochambeau is a fundraiser. See you Oka Week! Okay, that's gotta be good. That's gotta be. <laughs> Speaking of homecoming, one more thing. Today in advisory, you guys are gonna vote for homecoming court representatives. We'll send a link out to student and teacher emails. And happy birthday today to Miss Felice. And that's all the announcements we have for today. Have a great day, everybody. Y ahora los anuncios en español para los en grado 12 que tienen interés en estudiar en la universidad y necesitan ayuda con La aplicación de la FAFSA um, tiene oportunidades de inscribir para reuniones informativas esta mañana y el miércoles que viene, la próxima, hay también oportunidades. Todavía coleccionamos cajas de cereales en la clase de advisory. En primer lugar está la clase de Miss Cole. En segundo lugar, un empate entre el Mr. Denton y el Mr. Neal. Por favor. Llevan algunas cajas de cereales para donar a uh, personas con necesidad en nuestra comunidad. Si eres un estudiante um, que no ha tomado un, una clase de nivel crédito dual y piensas en tomar una el año que viene, uh, si estás considerando nada más, debes inscribir para um, el Titan Time mañana con una sesión uh, llamada 
Um, dual credit, first steps, create ID number. Uh, búscame a mí o un consejero si tienes alguna pregunta. En los deportes, el equipo de básquetbol con los muchachos uh, es esta tarde uh, de nivel grado 9 y um, Junior Varsity contra Spencer County y nuestras muchachas mismo deporte de básquetbol tiene su juego contra presentation esta misma noche a las 7 y media todo en nuestro gimnasio buena suerte titanes y para la semana que viene celebramos el homecoming otra vez um, esta vez para el invierno vamos a tener temas para cada día um, ya puse algunos en inglés y si tengo tiempo voy a traducir los temas para los días y además uh, va a ser un juego de piedra, um, tijeras y papel. Piedra, papel y tijeras. Pues depende. Si no saben qué hacer, búscame a mí. Voy a enseñar cómo se juegue y cuál es el plan que uh, hicieron algunos estudiantes en el video que ya puse. Y en la clase de advisory van a votar para representantes para la corte del homecoming. Va a ser durante el advisor va a recibir un enlace para votar en uh, tu email escolar. Y también hoy es el cumpleaños de Miss Felice. Feliz cumple. Esos son los anuncios para hoy. Espero que todos pasen un buen día. Um, hasta luego. Bye.